Let us pray. God our Father, you restore us daily through repentance and forgiveness so that we may live in your kingdom forevermore. You have invited us to raise our prayers to you in the name of Jesus, your beloved Son, and have promised to hear and answer us with all that is best for us. Give us continuing confidence and trust in you, and teach us to be content with what your wisdom and love supply. Lord, in your mercy, hear our prayer. God our Father, bless our nation and those in authority over us. Give our leaders good health, insight, and your favor. Teach us to be obedient and faithful citizens who willingly supply the resources needed to provide for the common good. Give us patience and wisdom that we may encourage and support all those who carry the heavy mantle of leadership in our land. Lord, in your mercy, hear our prayer. God our Father, you daily and richly equip us with all things need needful for this body and life. Give friendship to the lonely, employment to those in need, fruitfulness to the earth, good reputation to the slandered, and protection to the unborn. Lord, in your mercy, hear our prayer. God our Father, be with those who put their hands to any useful task and service to others, including those who quilt. Bless their labors, and may their hearts be filled with your love and your care. Lord, in your mercy, hear our prayer. God our Father, be with the sick, the suffering, the anxious, the grieving, and the dying. May everyone who calls on you find comfort in your abiding presence and healing according to your gracious will. Let your holy angels be with them, that the evil foe may have no power over them. Lord, in your mercy, hear our prayer. God our Father, with joy we recall the saints of old upon whom you bestowed your compassion. We praise you for your unending mercy and for calling us to faith through the living voice of your word. Grant to us the healthful spirit of your grace that what you have begun in us may be brought to completion when Christ appears in his glory on the last day. Through Jesus Christ our Lord, who lives and reigns with you in the Holy Spirit, one God now and forever. Amen.